Hi everyone, this is Rob Horlacher from Project Sandbox, a University of Lethbridge Library initiative. Um, this is the third video in a series of videos teaching you how to print at the University of Lethbridge. Uh, this video is specifically going to focus on how you can use the web app to print. So to do that, we're first going to go into a browser. Just from any browser you might be in, what you want to do is type in printing.uleth.ca. Once you do that, it'll bring you to the printing website. You'll just click on the little print button and then put in your user ID and password. Once we get in, you click on campus. Um, and then you can set up all of your stuff. So you can choose your file, whatever that might be. Um, so what I'm going to do is do my printing videos are awesome document. Um, put in the number of copies I want and then the page range. Um, one thing I should mention too is if you do have a web page with a specific URL, like say you wanted to print off our uleth.ca website, you would be able to put that in there. Um, we don't want to do that though. So after you're done that, you just hit continue. Um, and here's where you can change all of your settings. So it defaults to double sided in black and white. If you want that changed, just make sure you click on the drop down menu and change it to what you might want. So for me, I want single sided and I want color. So I'll change it in there. Um, something to mention is if you click on the color option, but print it off at a black and white printer, it's still gonna charge you for the color printer that you originally asked for. So make sure you're going to the correct printer for the correct uh, document that you want to be printed. Um, once you're done that, you hit continue, and then it'll say that your job is processing. Once it's done, it'll say complete, and then you can go to a printer. So through the magic of snapping, let's go to one of the printers. So through the magic of snapping my fingers together, as you can see, I am now in front of the printer. Um, the printer that I'm at is a black and white printer. The main thing you want to do whenever you choose a printer to print out at the library is that it's actually the type of printer that you want to go to. Um, what I mean by that is if it's a color printer, you want to go to either level 11 of the library. Um, you can find a color printer just outside the Kerr lab, um, or you can go to level nine of the library where there's also a color printer. If you want black and white, you can come to level 10 North um, where this one is right here, or you can go to level 10 south. Um, the one thing to keep in mind with that printer though is, is there's no photocopier or scanner attached to it, but if all you want to do is print, that one's good for you. After you choose which type of printer you want, um, the next thing you need to do is actually print your photo. So the first thing that you'll want to do to print off a photo is you'll want to swipe your card. After you swipe your card, you'll see a bunch of different choices you can choose from. If for some reason you leave this screen, and let me just see if I can do it. Uh, so if for some reason you re leave the screen and you wanna go back to your actual printing screen, um, say you're at something like this, you just need to hit that print copy scan button. Once you hit that button, it'll take you back to where you're supposed to be. From there, you just need to hit follow you printing and then select whichever document you want to be printed. So I just want this top one printed for now. Um, if I wanted the other ones, I could select them, um, but I don't. So I'm just gonna deselect those and just print off the photo. So uh, after you click on that, the piece of paper that you printed will be printed off. Obviously, I don't need to say printing that many times. But there you go. So once you're done printing off your documents, the next thing you want to do is just log out of this screen um, so that other users aren't gonna use your information. So if you notice, there's a logout button at the very top. Um, that's actually not the one that you're supposed to press. 
You're supposed to press this one in the bottom left hand corner. So we're just going to press that. It's going to log us out. We hit OK. And we're done. So thank you very much for watching this video. Um, I want to first of all thank Printing Services for going over all this information to make sure that it's still correct. Um, and I just want to remind you if you want to keep up to date with all of the new tutorials and stuff coming out of the library, um, just remember to subscribe to our channel. Um, and if you would like to watch other printing videos in this printing series, you can see um, two boxes on my right hand side with uh, future videos to watch. Um, once again, thank you very much and I hope you watch the rest of these.